is a young dancer who won the nation's hearts in Wednesday night's semi-final. He's been dying to get out here and perform again, and now he's ready to dance like he's never danced before. It's James Hobley. <laughs> What's your name? James. You're an extraordinary dog. Through to the next round. Our royal family would like to see James. When Simon said my name, gosh, I couldn't believe it. James. I'm feeling on cold nine at the moment. I'm just really ecstatic, to be honest. James Hobley is, to me, what this competition is about. Passion, heart, and talent. Dance is so important in my life. It's like eating, breathing, living or sleeping. When I dance, I feel free. I feel like I can't really control myself, but I'm just dancing. My dream was always to dance in front of massive audiences. I just can't imagine myself doing anything else, to be honest. This is a massive night for James. I just hope he goes out there and dances his heart out. If I won Britain's Got Talent, it would be really a life-changing moment. I just can't imagine what it would be like if he actually went on to win the competition. It would just top everything. I can't think of a moment that could ever be bigger than that. Ladies and gentlemen, James Hobley. Cross over to the judges. Simon, we'll start with you for me. Uh, James, you know, I said it last time, I'll say it again. I think you're absolutely brilliant. You are <laughs> fearless. Did you come up with the routine yourself? No, it's only uh, yesterday. Well, yeah, I, I had to um, get it to two minutes, so we basically choreographed it from um, basically you know, the start of the um, what was going to be the final routine. So we basically made it a new routine but with the same music from the same from the first round so it's a lot of pressure to pull it all wow. off today wow wow <laughs> well you know I, I've, I've never really been a massive fan of individual dancers particularly that kind of dancing but there's something about you you know that i think you interpret the music incredibly well you're very passionate you're absolutely into this gave it a hundred percent i think you could do well tonight congratulations <laughs> You know, James, every time you dance, it's almost like you put me in a trance. I can't stop watching you. And, you know, you're going to have a huge, long, fantastic career as a dancer. 
Tonight, you really did beautifully. Congratulations. You were in the trance. Yeah, James, you, you might have only had a day to get ready, but you absolutely um, did. I thought it was better than the semi-final for me, because you kept it simple, and we could just watch and enjoy your dancing. I felt in the semi-final was a lot of smoke. I lost you a lot in the sort of clouds, <laughs> but we could yeah. just focus on you and your gift. And it was graceful and magnificent. And the end was very much like how, how I get out of bed every morning. <laughs> <laughs> Amanda. Um, yeah, I, it's, a, it's a weird thing to watch sort of modern dance, like Simon said, and have it touch you. As you, you, you just always touch me every time I see it. You've overcome so much. It's not about your story. It's about your talent. And I think you, you won everybody over this evening again. So well done. <laughs> Well done, Nick. Well done. A good final performance. And if you think James Hobley is fit for royalty, the number to call is 09011-3222-04. But remember, you can't call until we've seen all of tonight's acts. Ladies and gentlemen, James Hobley.